I saw this photograph of, of Nellie Bly, this black and white photograph. She looked very determined. And, um, and I was intrigued by this woman with this little bag that traveled around the world. So I didn't know who she was, so, but that was the first thing that caught my attention. Rosie de Palma did uh, the voiceover of one of my films. And for me, when I, when I met her, I was very happy to work with her. She's like, oh, I love it. And we decided to do it together. So after that, uh, it became uh, very clear that Nelly Bly was almost an excuse uh, at the beginning and a point of departure. J'aime beaucoup le sens d'humour de Jessica, comme elle arrive à tout mélanger et sa propre vision. On nous rappelle un peu le cinéma mouette, aussi euh, faire hommage à Nelly Bly, cette femme qui a eu le courage d'être la première femme qui a fait le tour du monde. I call it a film with some live elements. So it's basically the opposite. In the theater I had, you know, I had the actors and then I had the multimedia, you know, as a support. This for me, it's almost the opposite. I have the film and then the live elements um, are, are a support for the film. So I started playing with different objects. I did the bag, I did the, the little bed. So I started playing with all these elements um, around the world of Nelly Bly. Every project I do, the aesthetics are very important. The fashion is very important. Uh, the objects and um, and I work a lot with collage so I feel like my pieces are also collage. It's a collage in the sense of how I prepare them but actually their form is, is, is like a collage too. Je suis très contente que la Fondation Hermès soutienne des projets comme ça parce que l'artiste il donne beaucoup mais il faut toujours avoir des complices.